Hi there, this is Mrs. McCarty, and this is our first um, message with Mrs. McCarty. We're going to call that Mrs. McCarty's Monday Message. And each Monday, you're going to get a short video, and it's just going to be something that could help you understand your child's school experience a little better. And if you have any questions ever, feel free to send them to me through class tag. So today I am gonna share with you some information that'll help you with your child because they're gonna be bringing home in the White Tuesday folder a baggie. And that baggie is gonna have all the materials that I share with you in this video. And in addition to that, it is also going to have a little instruction sheet so that if you forget anything from the video, you can just read along on there. So this activity is a name activity and there's actually three parts to it. So I'm gonna go over um, activity one and activity two with you so that you can help your child with learning their name. Let me change my camera so you can see exactly what your child will be bringing home and how to use it. So as you can see here, I have a name tag with my full name. You wanna pull that out of the bag first. And then you want to also take out of the bag there is a smaller bag and it has your child's name in cut apart letters, okay? So the first job we're gonna ask your child to do, which is activity one, is you are going to support your child where they match up the letters in their name. So I'm gonna say, okay, let's take a look at this letter. Now look down here, where do you see a letter that looks the same? When your child selects the correct letter or you assist them, you're gonna have them put that letter that matches just underneath that same letter. Once that is complete, meaning all of the letters have been correctly matched, uh, you can either do this while your child is building their name, or you can do this at the end where you're gonna to touch the letters and help them name them. So we would say uppercase K, E, L, L, Y. Kelly. The next step is activity two. And in activity two, your child is gonna need the dry erase marker that's also included in that baggie. This time your child is going to trace the letters on their whole name tag. So not the cut apart letters. At this point, you could actually scoot those out of the way and put your child's full name tag in front of them. You wanna take the time to help your child realize that when they trace their name, they should start with the first letter before moving on to any letters after that. So once they have uh, traced over top of all the letters of their name, then activity two would be complete. Again, just recognizing and naming those letters. There's my L, I have two L's, and then my last letter is a Y, and you would encourage them to do all of the letters. Once that is complete, that is how step one and step two, or activity one and two, are going to be handled. This is something I would recommend you working on with your child two to three times per week. Also in the baggie is a just a tissue, and that can easily wipe off the name tag. You don't need to add any water. It is a dry erase marker, so that dry uh, tissue will work just fine. You wanna store those objects uh, back in their bags and keep this at home. It does not need to come back to school. Lastly, if your child is successful with that, you can feel free to have your child use the dry erase marker or a regular marker and write that on paper. Again, focusing on one uppercase letter and the rest lowercase letters. And that would be the final stage of writing the name. I hope that the Monday message was helpful. Like I said, these materials will be coming home with instructions in your child's White Tuesday folder this week. The materials will stay at home for you to practice and use whenever you feel it's necessary. And my recommendation is two to three times a week. The last thing I'm gonna add is that the same exact activity, um, activity one, activity two and three, we're also gonna be seeing those through here at school. They have the same set of name tag cut apart letters with the dry erase marker. The whole thing is identical and we will be doing the same thing here. So feel free to reach out if you have any other questions otherwise. 
look for my next message on another Monday. Take care.